Generic greetings and welcome back to Prison Architect Warden Mode. In the previous episode, we got a lot of foundations placed. As you can see, the kitchen and canteen land mass is all built, as well as different areas around here and basically all the way up and down the uh, right hand side. So that's quite good. We have walkways that go along the outside, which we will pretty much be going for a. I think it's going to go for a concrete tile all the way along. In fact, I'm going to do that right now because I think it would be worth it. Also, we've got ones on the outside there, which I know... Um, I, I'm assuming that uh, a lot of people will be uh, complaining about because of the wasted space, but I'm also planning on expanding this to the left, so let's just see uh, what happens there. But either way, we're progressing on quite nicely. A decent amount of money, 42 grand, obviously it's going to uh, be reduced by the time I've built all of this, but um, that's not, not, not too much of a problem. I'm not too sure whether I'm going to be putting um, entrances in here and here so we can get access to this. I think I probably will because then it gives my warden actual access to it, like personally. Uh, it, it's going to be good for us, but um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Actually, will it though? Because I will not have a key for these jail doors. I only have keys for... I only have a staff key, so I can only go through staff doors. So I'll have to wait for other people. Anyway... Let's just see how this one goes. So this episode, what I want to do is get another grant done, which is quite simple because I can just go to one and then two, three. Job done. There's a grant easily done. 44 grand. That means we can pick up another grant, which is visitation rights. And because of that, we can now go up and do visitation here. But what we really want to do is um, we want to build a lot of... Uh, well, a lot of cells. I want to build a cell block, really. I want to get cell block A completed. But for the time being, and... Oh, my God, does that rotate around properly now? No, it doesn't. It's still glitchy as hell. But I can see what they've done there. So I want to put in... There. 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 Actually, do I want to do it like that? Or do I want to put it next to each other? That should do it. And then on this side as well. And hang on, that's wrong. What have I done there? Oh, because there's a gap. I was going to say, that's strange. Why is it like that? And there we go. And we've got some extra areas for our CCTV and such. So that's our visitation all done. We've got common room, pool table, uh, at least two TVs, all of that sort of thing. Still have got power in here because I did place the wrong thing, as people, uh, I'm guessing, have pointed out. But I, I haven't seen the comments. I see I do a bit of a pre-record now because of uh, the way YouTube works, uh, sadly, because otherwise it gets demonetized and then you have to flag it and then... Uh, 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 what a time to be alive. So, uh, electrical cable, we'll uh, build that back up there. But we do need to do the water because I haven't um, placed either that bit there. And also, if we go further down, I haven't expanded it up here, which will be... Uh, I think this is the center. Let me just double check. It is... That so yes, that is the center which will go up like so and obviously we then need to go for small pipe and gonna connect that up there uh, We are gonna have everything else on the other side. So that's fine. Uh, that is not connected up yet because of uh, That bit so that's now all done. So we've got the yard put in we've got not we haven't got the walkways But let's let's do the concrete tiles I think it's gonna be worth us putting the tiles in because then we have a, a faster run We can run a lot further a lot faster and it means it's just going to just cut our journey time off. And considering we're going to be doing it anywhere, like we will be placing these anywhere, it's not really going to... It's not going to cost us a massive amount. Like, it might cost us, say, five or six grand to do. But... I think it's going to be worth it. And there we go. Right. They'll crack on with that. And then we'll do the insides. Oh, that's not... Oh, it's not light. It's not lit up. That's because of the, the distance, you see. So, we do want to build this cell block here. So, let's go for foundation building brick. And we'll just do this one like that. So, it's going to be a... What did I measure it as? That. So, three. So, we'll have a... Hmm... Do we have, have just a small jail door? I think we might have to. Might cause some fights on that one, but we'll see how it is. So a lot of guards. I did hire 12 accidentally in the last episode, but, you know, we, we're going to need them anywhere. That's the excuse I'm using. Um, we also haven't got surveillance or dogs. We're going to get armory and dogs and surveillance. We'll just unlock the lot. Uh, we'll lock, unlock prison policy. 
I'm not going to get land expansion yet, but I think that's something we will be going for. And now we will build this, which will be our cell block. So uh, there is a quick build for a basic cell, and as you can see, it can just be clicked and placed. And to be honest with you, I think it's totally sufficient and pretty much what I'm looking for. Apart from the fact that I have to mirror it on the other side, which is going to be a bit of a nightmare. Um, now I... Oh, yes, I will put that one in there. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and rotating around, it'll be... It'll be, it won't be cloned, so I want to flip it, so I will, I will build the other one on the other side manually, but I will also run an electrical cable down in the centre? No, we'll run it like that. There you are. So that'll be all that lit up, and that's going to be some of our cells. Obviously, we are going for cell block A, which requires us to... get 15 cells which is this is more than sufficient in terms of capacity not very high at all I'm gonna have to do this I think it's gonna have to be that technically don't need it like that I could have that I'll see I'll see how it goes yeah technically don't need um these extra bits. Why is that not why is that stopped? I think it's because I was right clicking to get rid of bits and bobs. Hmm. Anyway, so rooms, cell. There you go. Yeah, in terms of capacity, not 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 stupidly high. Haven't worked it out exactly. But it's not gonna be off the dial or anything. So put all the beds in. And then this cell will be cell block A. Which will probably be... I don't think I'm going to go for high risk just yet. I think that's going to be... I think we are going to expand. I think at the speed of our building, we're really going to be a fair bit well on after maybe seven or eight episodes. So we'll probably have low and medium in here. And then on the left-hand side expansion, we'll have any additional things we've missed out. And then we'll have death row... Supermax, uh, high risk, all of that sort of stuff on that side. So there's our cell block A done. We've got security procedure certification, which is very easy to do because, as you can see, we just need to sign three uh, guards to patrol routes, which, well, for a start, we'll have guard patrols and we'll have um, the guard patrolling along there, across and down. The reason I'm not putting it in the centre is because I don't know what I'm going to do in the centre just yet. Um, where is the wall? I wish there was bit more contrast. We'll have that. Go further up a bit. Put that in there. Another guard patrol. We'll have along here. Ooh! That's too much a sign. It's because I'm pressing shift all the time and that um, that makes them it, it gives you an alternate building mode. So there's another grant done. Very easy. Got cell block B, a governmental security ratings, which we... I think we can get. Cell block B as well. We'll go for governmental. And let's put some water in here. Now, in terms of the... In terms of the... Shower, I could just do that. Do I want to keep it open? And just do that. It's different from what I've done before. So yes, I think we do. The question is, do I want to put grates in the centre? No. Not yet. Not yet. Okay, so. Concrete tiles. Straight up. This is going to be the model cell block. Alright, so once we've done this, we know what it's going to be like. In terms of the flooring in each of the cells, normally I'd go with concrete tiles. Maybe something different. Um, can have white tiles in here, obviously. Mosaic, perhaps? No, we'll just go with concrete. Concrete tiles are the way to go. They look some of the best. And then we'll max speed that out, and then this should be done. So, doesn't require hot water. We've turned that off. The question is, will the cold water reach down the bottom? That's a lot of pipe. That's 30-odd distance. I don't think it will. 
I don't think it will. So I think we're going to have to plumb large pipe in. Like that. Right, and then we'll just do this. You might be noticed the camera's like moving now and again. That's because people are walking past me or I'm trying to go past them and it's <laughs> shuffling me along. There we go. So that's the model cell block. Yeah, see that look? When I try to walk past them, the, uh, the, push me pa the push is along. <laughs> so, there's that in. Uh, we don't have access. It's very interesting that the warden, you do have line of sight from where he's been for a little bit. And you will have line of sight for CCTV. But you don't from the guards. Which means this place is going to have more CCTV than almost any other room, uh, any other prison I've made. And it's going to be in here. So we'll have CCTV, CCTV, CCTV. I mean, just more CCTV all over the place. In fact, we might even shrink down this because it's, it's, it's a bit too big. This is going to be where the dogs are. In fact, um, kennel is a 5x5. Five five. We're going to do that. And then armory is that. Okay. So dismantle. Demolish walls. Build walls. Put the concrete back in. And put the jail door back in. Alright. So that's your dog. Create kennels. There you go. Armory. Have to have a weapons rack in here. Have to have a table. Mm. And then guard lockers. And then we can put some down the bottom. There we are. So there's them done. Why haven't we done that bit? Strange. Right. Uh, staff room. I think we'll have that as flooring. I'm trying to finish the rooms off as I progress on, but I know it's it's just not going to... Realistically, it's not going to happen. From, in most cases. So, but we'll try and put... Sit drinks machines. Arcade cabinets. Still don't know whether you use those. Whether you use them or not. Um, and the radio. They're all in now. That's fine. So, there's that. According to our visitation rights, we need common room, pool table, two TVs. That's fine, but quite honestly, I think we need to get this place done. We need to get this place done. Actually, what I'm going to do before I do that is get a metal detector in here because we're always going to put one in. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and put down all the metal detectors for the prison. And I've also realised that I'm doing all of this and I've never in recent times checked the power grid it's okay but probably best to put some more capacitors in like that in fact considering I'm going to do the rest of the kitchen I think that's more than sufficient <laughs> right so we need to do kitchen and canteen so let's just smash that flooring down there you go that was a simple task and Oh my good grief. Uh, yeah, eight grand on flooring. This is why I normally don't place it first. So, we want to have these copied over. So, we could try and clone it. Do we try? Yeah, that's, can we clone it? I think that's going to place a light. Will it work? It's going to place lights. Actually, it's not going to matter because there's already lights in there. In the exact place where I put them anywhere. Alright, I'll take it. <laughs> no problem there. Although there's not here. Yeah, it's placing a light. It is placing a light. So, cancel the light. I'll just do that manually. That's oh, already placed. Dismantle. We'll use that light later on. Okay. And I've also not placed it right on the edge, so, you know. Oh, in that case, it would work. In that case, it would work. Yeah, clone. 
You've already got a light in, you see. <laughs> Perfect. Right. The, I'll have to do the rest manually, though. So, it's tables. Do I just want to do that? Or do I want to squeeze it in like that? I think squeeze because, quite honestly, we don't know how much expansion we're going to do and all of that. Although, realistically, if we are expanding with high risk and supermax and all that, we're going to have another canteen up top. But, let's just put loads of these in. Like that. And then, phone booths at the end there. Because they're always useful. We could even put them in the centre, but I'd rather keep the area just a little bit open. Probably enough phone booths for the majority of people anyway. If not, we can put another row there in other places. Uh, that dingling noise means we do have uh, another bit of the visitation rights grant done. Which is good. So, common room pool table, at least two TVs. So, that's okay. But we're going to go back in here and... Actually, no, we're not. We're going to get uh, some dog handlers and some... Yeah, we'll get dog handlers and we'll get the armed guards. So, first things first, staff, canine, one, two, three. Armed guards. This, right. This is the thing. I, I do tend to overuse armed guards. Armed guards are very good at stopping violence but they're also they really knock things like attention span and grading and anything to do with learning because essentially the prisoners are pacified they're not they're seeing these guards and going well if i kick off i know what could happen so they're not really i wouldn't say behaving on their own initiative that's not the right term but i don't really know how else to put it they're not behaving because of their well it is their choice but obviously they've done the quick mental maths and went I can't do this and I'm only being good as the, the armed guard allows me to be whereas if you don't have them armed guards and they have the choice and you're doing everything else right then it's better for teaching and reform which is what we like trying to do so anyway that's what I was trying to say don't even know if I've said it properly but hey ho uh, so dog patrols so I have a dog patrol along here. Like that. One dog patrol. And same up the top. So it is. Where am I building it from? Hang on, let me check this side. This is the warden mode thing. Obviously I have to worry about where I've got it. I'm sure there'll be inconsistencies all over the place. Don't worry, um, I'm not going to go back to fix them, unless they're a major one. <laughs> Some people like me to be very pedantic about it, some people are not too bothered. I'll just do my best. So there's that. Uh, I do need to have two armed patrols, and quite honestly, the armed patrols will be... I can't believe I'm navigating this in the white space, because <laughs> it's really difficult. The patrols will be that, and that, and then we're going to cancel those off, and then there's that grant done. So, another grant, we've got MacSec infrastructure, uh, max sec, so that's uh, increased size of security force, and like body armor, tasers, all that sort of thing. I'm going to go for cell block B instead, and we will finish off, or at least get most of this area done. So one, two, three cookers, one, oops, one, two, three, four. Fridges will go along like so, and then along there, and then obviously we do need to put in another sink. We could even put another two sinks in if we really wanted to, which I think is going to be okay, although the problem is that they have to then walk around, but slightly inefficient, I know, but hey-ho. It'll do us. Then that, and then that. That's all now connected up. So. I think we'll have a fence. And we'll put the fence in. Like that. And like this. And we are gonna put some we are gonna put some um some doors in so we can get in and out. Actually, while I'm on with this electrical cabling stuff. Um probably that's the best way of doing it. And that's already connected up just because of the quirk of the game. Actually, that's probably best to do it that way, isn't it? Yeah, that's cheaper. 
That's fine. Right. So, that's connected up. That's connected up. That's connected up. That's connected up. So, while I'm here, morgue, storage, that, this, staff room, all the offices, um, kennel armory, all that's going to be staff only, same as the offices outside. Could make reception staff only, but I don't really, doesn't really matter, because they will, they will go in there. If you make it staff only, they will go in there, because they have to. Um, what I'm also going to do is go for prisoner direction. And it's that. So they'll always try and go that way. Whether or not that works is... Well, we'll see, won't we? <laughs> oh, and you actually see the painting on there. I thought it was just uh, in the background, but no, it is actually fully painted there. So if we wanted to, we could have a, a way so the prisoners come in the side and then leave out the other. So the prisoners come along, then they go around and in. That wouldn't make any sense, though, because the prisoners are mostly going to be in their cells, and they're going to come out and then in here. So we can have them go in here and then out this out this out bit here. So it's almost a one-way system. Um, what I mean by that is uh, this. So we could have it come along here and down and out like that. Like, that's the priority. Does that work? I have absolutely no idea. It's going to be interesting finding out though, isn't it? Cool. There you are. Right. Um, although, I'm not a big fan of where I've put that one. There you go. Right. We'll just try it. It can only not work and we remove it. So, no harm, no foul there, I don't think. So, uh, shower heads. We haven't got those in yet. Yes, it was an oversight. And yes, I did try to say that... Uh, I, I did I did do the maths on that one and go, do you think I could get away with saying I knew about it in the first place? No, I totally forgot and I just came in here and noticed it. <laughs> but it's why, to be fair, it is why I came in here just to check to see if there's anything else to make. And there is something else to make. Uh, the reason I came in here was actually to put the benches in. But, uh, yeah. Uh, do you want to put a bench in here? I don't think so. It's a bit too cramped. So we'll probably put this in... Do we really want benches in the middle? They don't, they're don't. they not going to sit on the mother. They always got the canteen. Now, we don't need to have them. We really don't need to have them. Okay, so I think we will leave it there. So we have a patrol. We have the cell block A done. And for the most part, the prison is almost complete. What I need to do is... Well, I'll do it now just so we know we're pretty much done ready next episode is put a wall on the back because this is going to be foundation so i'd rather place a wall now than have to worry about it later on and then a large jail door will go there large jail door will go in there and in um probably in there and in there and yes i know this is introducing some weaknesses to the prison but honestly if i didn't have this it would be a nightmare to navigate. We'll even put them on that side as well. And it's still going to be difficult to navigate because I won't have a... I, I don't have, in fact, a key for these doors. It does say carrying a staff key. And they have, if I pause it, jail keys. So they only the guards can open this jail door. However, there's a way of getting around it. And that's if you go to your... Um, where is it? This mode here, which is um, recruiting mode and fighting and such. I can recruit Warden Protection. See on the top right? Cost per day, 500 generic units of currency a day. And he will always follow me around, which is going to be very useful. It does cost a lot. We're already at a big deficit. So we need to get prisoners and we need to get them soon. As in, we need to get them next episode, which is what we'll be doing. So... I can hire, if I did hire him, it would cost money, but also they would follow me around, which means they'd be, they'd have keys on hand very, very, you know, at, at, at the moment's notice. So we could do that, we could do that. Uh, what I do want to do is, got body armor and tasers, well not both, 
only a little bit but once we buy it then it's going to start going up and then i'll get myself some body armor don't think i need it yet uh because of the way the game is and the, pr the type of prisoners we're going to get i don't think we will need it but i think it is uh probably it's probably going to be worth the the expenditure early on there's no reason i'm just going to lock that open there and that one that's our security doors i think it's gonna be worth it in the long run so we'll see what happens anyway we're going to leave it there not bad Quite happy, quite happy. Next episode, prisoners. What sort of prisoners? Almost certainly medium risk. I don't know about law. Probably medium because of the money. It's going to be a financial decision. So yeah, we will see how it goes. Just trying to think of anything else to do. Funds in three, well, a couple of minutes. Yeah. Yeah, it's prisoners, I think. Yeah, we'll have a quick check around. Do the odd bit here and there. I think that we have to put some weight benches in the yard. But other than that, getting there. Prisoners next episode then. As always, hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks very much for watching. Take care. And generic partings also. I need to do all the reports, which is the policy of the regime. And uh, yeah, 